Welcome to another episode of the Upshot Project. This week we're back outside and we're going to be trying to find as many animals as we can. And to do so, what we're going to do is we're going to go for a bit of a hike and we're also going to even kayak to try and see if we can find any animals of any kind. But as you can hear, like, there's a lot of birds and hopefully we find some and maybe even something slightly bigger. Let's find out. Can you go first? I don't want to go inside a web. Well, that's the first spider web. What's significant about that part of the tree is that it's been bitten by a beaver. So we think. So salt things. I have no idea. I'm not a Canadian. A nest. <laughs> I'm no uh, zoologist, but uh, a nest like that probably houses the Canadian moose. No. It's a lot of bugs, sweet, huh? What was the bird that we just found? Perdrix. 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 We haven't found too many birds. They use, they're up in the canopy, so they're a bit harder to find, but what we have found are things like this. Ah, oh, cuties. There are about as many bugs as you would find in an Australian rainforest. <laughs> or just the bush. It's quite, quite impressive. And also, not to mention all the spiderwebs, <laughs> which I'm walking at the front, so that way Solan doesn't have to deal with them. Ain't that right? Wait, <laughs> I'm not even ashamed. I'm hungry. I'm Hayden. You see it? Mm-hmm. Oh, wait. Side period. Now that it's gone, The second one was a frog. <laughs> I think. Or a toad. One of the two. Yeah, so a little over 5Ks, two main animals, a metric buttload of bugs. Yeah. It was a good walk, but it's, I'm very happy to be back. <laughs> Get some food and then off to jump in the water. Straight out, or you want to follow the water, like the water's edge? Yeah. Okay. Ah, oh, there's weight! Ah! My arms hurt. In summary, we've had an absolute cracker of a day. Saw quite a few birds, seagulls, one possible eagle, but honestly, uh, not as many animals as we were hoping. What should they do if they like this view? I was hoping you would tell them. Oh, oh they, I was, subscribe, like, and comment. Oh, that was terrifying. Yeah. Sol's uh, one of those people, very much like Nate from Kara and Nate, who gets hangry, but not because she's hungry, 
but because it's hot and she gets angry. I have no patience. No patience. I wonder why I'm going to live in Australia. Yeah. I'm going to be angry all the time.